Now this option trade returned 44% profit in just a few days versus 3.5% for the stock. Stay tuned. Okay, here is the uh, trade idea right off my insider members tr trade idea sheet. This is exactly how I print it out for them. So on July 12th, I said I'm looking at a re-entry buy. So where's July 12th? July 12th is right here. So what it, Gilead had been in a pretty good downtrend and then it made this really strong move to the upside here. Got above this previous little uh, high here. And I liked the way this had taken off, good volume coming in. And then we got this pullback and the moving averages were aligning to the upside. I used the 10 exponential as my trigger line. I have a 21 simple and a 55 simple for, uh, to kind of set the, uh, the intermediate um, the trend. So I've got short term and intermediate trend. They both turned higher. We got a pullback. And on the 12th, I got a close back above that 10 day moving average. That's what I like to see. So I said, I want to buy slightly above the high of that day. The high was 70.13. I had an entry point at 70.38. Said I'm looking at the option, the August 70 calls. And here we are in uh, on July 12th, so giving ourselves plenty of time, not the current month, out into the next month. And I'm using the standard monthly expiration, you know, the third Friday of the month. All right, so we're going to be slightly in the money, practically an at-the-money type of, uh, of call. And the stop was going to be two consecutive closes below that 10-day uh, exponential moving average. I had a target, a 7282. That's right up in this area, right up here. Okay. So the very next day, we got an entry on the 13th. We broke above, we hit the 7038 uh, entry point and bought four of the August 70 calls at 257. Okay. So I, for the trade idea purposes, I buy at the ask and I sell at the bid just to be conservative. Uh, and of course, the insider members are trying to beat those entry points for sure. Okay, so 257 we're in, and now we're trading, we're tracking up to the upside. And when we got into the day, so literally on the 19th, we're one, two, three, four, the fifth day in this trade, fifth trading day. Uh, we got where we were closing and pushing right into the high. We got very, very close to the target. We were only eight cents away. And honestly, a target is exactly that. It's a target. When you get really close to the target, you got to decide. I mean, do you, are you happy with what we're doing here at the end of the day? Or do you want to just sit and ride it out? So I went ahead and exited at right at the close, into the close of that day. Uh, and exited for 370. So $113 profit. I'm losing my voice here. $113 profit per contract, 44% on the trade in five trading days. Now, what could we have done better? We could have done better by sitting with this a little bit longer and trailing, a, you know, some kind of trailing stop and could have had a, a much more substantial return at 44%. But what did we get? 44% versus three and a half percent on the stock between 7038 and 7282 that is a three and a half percent movement in the stock the option appreciated over 12 times what the stock gave you all right that's the power of options trading hey did you like that video and give me the thumbs up and one other thing head on over to my website and get on my email list thanks for watching i'll see you on the next video